guys so today we are going to do uh change these hidden roku settings man i hate these hidden roku settings that just are freaking annoying so um some are good some are bad uh some you probably don't care for we're gonna go through them if you do have a roku make sure you guys do grab your remote and we are gonna jump into it now with that being said i always um i always leave in the description below links to anything um that i think is really good i've actually ran into a really good vpn service it's a brand new one um that i've been able to test out and i actually love it a lot um i've had a few people already been messing with it and they're just like dude thank you for the switch so check in the description below for my subscribers. I got something exclusive for you guys. Uh, yeah, so let's go ahead and begin. So let's come here to the Roku. Now, first thing is um, you want to come all the way down to settings. Now, from here, um, you want to go down, go to the right, and then come down all the way to privacy now with privacy, I uh, so I like how they add these advertisements things um, where they leave it unchecked. Limit ad tracing. So this is just like the Fire Stick where they want to grab your your information so that way they can personalize stuff. Um, so just so you know, when you limit ad tracing, it stops Roku from personalizing ads on your Roku device and sharing viewing data from streaming channels on this Roku device for measurement purposes. So they will still populate with ads, but they're not tracking what you're doing to give you ads that you want to see. It's just going to be a bunch of random stuff. Um, so I want to turn that off. So uh, limit, limit, make sure you do check that off. Okay, so now the next thing is for microphone. You could change uh, your channel microphone access. So, for example, um, when, a, when a channel first tries to access the microphone, you could either prompt it to get a pop-up or you could always allow uh, whatever you want to do. Never allow, always allow, or prompt you. So right now I have it to prompt. I like always allow. If I'm going to hit the microphone on my button, I just want it to work. So there you go. Channel permissions. If you need to give anything permissions, this is where you're going to set it to. Um, now, the next thing is, I think this is very, very important here. When it comes to your system update, how to keep your stuff updated. So here it says um, the last time it checked. And all you got to do is, is, I don't know if you can see the check now. Just check now for new software. As you can see, this was just a couple days ago. It says oh, everything's up to date. So there you go. You're good to go. So we're going to go ahead and back out of here. Now, if you do want to check your network, if you come here, you can go to your about uh, check connection. You want to come here and you want to check your connection. And this will give you everything that you need to know. Um, themes. This is actually really, really cool. You could actually do theme packs here. So um, right now it just has the standard Roku and you could choose like whatever theme pack you want. Um, they have all kinds of stuff here so you could do like space theme jungle theme space theme jungle theme you got kids all kinds of stuff here um they also have like seasonal themes which i think it's kind of cool um it's it's recommended as on so just keep that in mind when the season changes then your images um, will change now on your home screen you might not want some of these features so for example it says featured free you could either show or hide it um, you got your movies and stores, you got your offers, and then shortcuts. So from here, you could add whatever shortcuts you want. So I know if you turn some of this stuff off, I like to leave it all on just because I like to see it. Some people really don't want to see those advertisements, so they'll turn off offers and stuff like that. Now, it does have Apple AirPlay and HomeKit. So this is actually pretty nice for, for you guys who do have that. So just keep in mind. Now, when it comes to audio, I've had people ask me about this. What about audio? Um, you could set, so right now I have it to auto detect, but you could actually set to Dolby Digital, Dolby Digital Plus, Dolby Digital DTS, Dolby Digital Plus DTS. Um, so pretty nice. Now, when you are setting some of this stuff up, um, I leave it to auto detect so that way it just detects whatever I have on my system. If you're noticing that it's not picking something up, then you could obviously change it right here and do whatever you want. So 
keep that in mind too. Now with your menu volume, you could either put it on high, medium, or mode. Um, your audio mode, you could go stereo or audio or auto, which is that's kind of where it's doing. This is where you could also change your languages. Now, of course, the, the last thing I want to go here is through your system. If you go to about, it'll tell you everything within your stuff. Um, some cool stuff here. You could do screen mirroring, which if you want to screen mirror your stuff, you just come here. You could always you could prompt, always allow stuff like that real easy. You could also block or, or, or allow devices automatically really good and you could also do a restart from here so instead of unplugging it you could just restart the whole thing right here um, it does have a guest mode if you do have a guest and you don't want them purchasing stuff you could go here enter a pin and then there you go and then that's pretty much it when it comes to the roku the roku has a lot of stuff here that is like very standard and basic and simple everything is is literally all right there um, if you are looking for something very specific uh, go through the settings because you'll find all kinds of stuff there. Let me know in the comment section below. Did I miss something that you think it's really important for people to know? Um, I know with the old Roku, it was easier to get into like some of the power. You could always leave your device on. Um, you, there, there's like other stuff, stuff that you could do. And now with the new updates that they've done, they've kind of taken some stuff away. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Is there anything that I'm missing? And yeah, with all that being said, you guys take care. Take care of each other. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care, guys.